hello everyone welcome to my channel my name is chile my in case you are stopping by for the first time you are highly welcome and for my old subscribers thank you for coming back so in today's video i want to show you guys how i made this beautiful jumbo not less jungle breads and if you're interested in seeing how i made this gorgeous wig you have to stay tuned and keep watching and please don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed yet to my channel and i hope to see you guys again keep watching i'll be right back so this is the full lace wig i'm using it's made out of kanikalon hoye made by me of course so first of make sure you fix your full legs wig tightly on your canvas head that means you have to use canvas head that matches the size of the fullest wig as for the braiding hair i'm using here i use two packs or three packs of braiding hair that's two colors color one and color 51 which is a kind of metallic gray so for the color one i cut into two because it's longer than the gray for the gray i did not cut at all and after cutting i did not stretch out the or feather out the tips just take it as it is and start breathing as we are pinching out the hair the tips start feathering out on its own so since i'm doing a jumbo i'm doing jumbo jumbo braids i'm going to part the hair as big as required or as possible and start braiding without adding the, in the extensions after braiding like three steps i'll start feeding the braids with my braiding hair so you can feed your braids from under as you are seeing here or from the top i use both or uh, both methods in this video so keep add adding the hair i first and uh, i started adding with the black hair then followed by the metallic gray I'll keep braiding to the point I'm comfortable or to the point I want to start pinching out hair from. So some people will ask barely that you can pinch account odd numbers before you pinch out hair. I know that I cannot keep up with counting the numbers I might miss my count. So I use my index finger that is my pointing finger as a guide. Any side the pointing finger holding the braid is pointing at that is the side my mind would tell me this is the side to pick from i hope you understand what i'm saying so in case you don't know you don't, you want, don't want to count just use your finger your pointing finger that's the index finger to as a guide any part any side of index finger is pointing it should be the side you pick from or you pinch hair from and pick small hair at a time don't pick chunks of hair and also this hair tends to be tangled this tie style always make sure you brush and smooth out the braids as you are braiding so I'll keep pinching the hair this way until I get to the tips keep watching So this is what the hair looks like after braiding it. So the next clip I'm going to show you to the hair tips, 
how I pinch the hair to the tips. You have to pick pinching till you get to a point where your head, your brain will tell you it's over. Okay. Once you are not more comfortable picking out the hairs, you should know that it's time to stop pinching out hair. So on this particular clip, in this clip, I'm going to show you from beginning to all the tips how or where I stopped pinching out hair once I get to the tips.
after bridging the whole hair i will go ahead and trim the hair a little bit especially the tips so this is what the hair looks like after bridging i'll go ahead and trim the hair as any excess fly away i'm going to trim them off after which i will dip the ends in hot water so this is me trimming the hair I'm not going to trim everything, you know, it's a jungle braid, it's supposed to look rough but not too dirty or too rough, just trim off any excess fly away, especially the ones at the tips. So this is the hair, next thing I'm doing now is to dip the ends in hot water, I'm not going to put all the hair, just the tips, I'm going to dip in hot water. Just watch how I'm dipping the tips in hot water. So the next is using my styling mousse to tame the hair down and make it look uh, neat and shiny. So guys, thank you for sticking with me. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you do, please don't forget to subscribe. If you have not subscribed yet, please, I'm begging you subscribe, share this video, share with your family and friends, share with your friends, share with your group, share with anyone around you. So this is what the inside of the wig looks like. And again, in case you want to order any of my products, Please do check the description box or you check my comment section the column that says to order a wig this is what the wig looks like total this is what the inside of the wig looks like you can style this wig you can style it up and down you can style it up um bun or up ponytail and down so guys this is the uh, final result of this wig and i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you have any question please do drop it in the comment section you know as usual i will answer your questions this is what the tips of the hair will look like please 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 if you have not subscribed yet to my channel please i'm begging you subscribe give the video a thumbs up if you enjoy watching it if you find this help uh, video helpful comment what you think about this hairstyle in the comment section and this is what this wig looks like packing it half up and half down so thank you again for sticking with me to this moment and i hope to see you guys in my next video i hope to see you till then bye